What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here, bringing you another episode of SimCraft here on Aviator Games. And you guys, last time we left off, we actually really got our marketplace going. And this city, you guys, that we started is looking a lot like a real life city. It's actually starting to function like one, and it's really making me excited. But you guys, before we hop into this episode, if you're still enjoying SimCraft, make sure you slap that like button, Lemonheads. It really does mean a lot. Let's go for 1,125 likes on this episode. But you guys, in today's episode, so we are going to continue to expand that marketplace and then decide where we want to go from there. I do want to add some fields and farms to the old city that's way over there because I feel like that's going to be beneficial. And that's That can be like, you know, our industrial city where we get all of our, our exports and uh, our imports and uh, we bring them to this city where this city is the thriving hustle and bustle city. Um, so that's probably one thing we're going to do. Um, I don't know what we need to build fields, so we'll probably check that out over here before we actually head over there. But let's grab a few supplies. So what I'm going to bring with me today is uh, probably just a few of these actual stacks of wood, um, of logs, because that's going to be easy. And then what else? Let's bring some fence posts just in case we end up needing those. I have a feeling we're going to. Um, and then, uh, that's probably about it out of this chest. Now, this chest right here will take a few stacks of cobblestone, just in case we end up needing any. Uh, then we do want some glass. So we'll take a 64 stack of glass. And we'll take a good amount of wool, 60 pieces of wool. Uh, and why not take a stack of dirt just in case we need to, to flatten any land or anything like that. So let's head out here. We're going to continue building this marketplace before we head over and start the fields. I know one thing I really want to put over here is a grocery store because I feel like it's something we're going to need. Um, so let's see. Uh, we have to measure the size. I think the bakery is pretty much finished. Now the bakery is really nice. She's building the bakery still actually. Okay. Oh, we got another sim that just wandered into the area. That's awesome. Oh, wait. What's in the bakery? Oh, it's got little cakes, um, a chest. I guess the baker can bake things, but they're probably going to need some type of supplies. Uh, it looks like, and the bakery is complete. Let's take this with us and that. Uh, we're also going to take the chest and the crafting kit. Okay, so let's see. Now that she's done with the bakery, what I really want to build is, let's, let's quickly connect this to the road here. I want to build the grocery store because it's something we're going to actually be able to use in this city. And I want to decommission all the other shops in the other city. Because the grocery store in this city won't be able to use because we're actually going to have fields working in the other city. Now, I just want to see how big the grocery store is. Let's just hire a pretend builder. Uh, okay, so let's see. Commercial, I think it is. Or, oh yeah, it is. Okay, 11 by 9 by five tall okay so nine back so let's go here okay so 11 uh so if we went uh one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven uh perfect okay so that's where it will go um get out of my way buddy uh let's put this chest here okay so 11 by that's uh one two three four five six seven eight nine okay so this is gonna fit it's going to fit right here. It's going to fit perfectly. So we're going to hire a builder. Let's see if Hercules, he is available. Uh, we are going to choose the grocery store. Oh, not residential. Uh, let's choose a building, commercial, grocery store, 106 planks. That is an easy build, you guys. That is a really easy build. Um, okay, so we're going to just quickly get all these started. So there's 64 plus. So that's 96. Um, no, and that's 101 and one two three four five so 106 planks that's all they needed right okay so we have 106 planks set up for them let's move all this stuff over here we're trying to keep this well organized so a grocery store is going to look really nice here uh it's going to run really well with the city i'm kind of excited to see how this all works out uh we should probably expand this road a little bit more because we can run it all the way basically and connect it somewhere over here probably i think we, there'll be a way where we can connect it over here even if it has to be like a one a one wide road to kind of be like an alleyway uh it, it'll work we'll make it work so let's go like this let's expand this road because then we can add a few more stores to this area i'm trying to think we need a maybe a butcher a butcher wouldn't be a bad one and i think i want to put a lumber mill like by the bank so maybe a butcher can go right here so let's see how big a butcher station is just kind of curious let's just pretend we're hiring a builder again um butcher uh eight by nine okay so eight by nine same width um let's go like this give me that sorry about that friend okay so let's go one two three four five six seven eight uh put that here let's hire a builder uh who's our next best we have griffin i uh, will hire griffin he's a level two builder 
Choose commercial, butchers, we need stone bricks, cobblestone, glass, and stone. Oh, yeah, these these are the complicated ones. How much cobblestone does he need? How much cobblestone? Was it 56? Okay, so let's give him this minus this minus that. Okay, so there you go. There's your 56. Um, and then he needed stone bricks um, and stone and then six glass. We have the six glass. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, so stone bricks and stone. He needs 147 stone. We're going to need an, a lot more. Oh, he finished the grocery store already? Holy crap. Okay, so the bakery and grocery store. We're not going to hire anyone in them yet because we don't have enough fields to produce materials for these buildings. So we're just going to kind of let these chill here for a little bit until we can get the fields up in the second city. <coughs> oh, God. I just choked on my, my, my spit. Okay, so let's see. Um, so 147 smooth stone and nine stone bricks i know we have the stone bricks we do not have any smooth stone i'm pretty sure uh we're gonna actually need the miners to start collecting cobblestone pretty soon again because we're running really low on our reserves it's it's getting bad so let's take this and this um what we're gonna do give me that so there's that and give me this and there's that okay so that's enough um for what we need those have to all smelt basically and become smooth uh, oh, we do have, oh wait, we do have 109 smooth stone. Uh, we need nine stone bricks, so let's let's get nine stone bricks. There's nine. Uh, okay, so we have, we have some smooth stone. So if we stand here for a little bit, we should be able to get uh, the rest of the smooth stone that the guy needs, and we'll be able to then start focusing on the industrial city over there. So let's just wait for a few more things to start smelting. Do we need anything else to take on this adventure? I think we're pretty good. We should be able to kind of complete uh, some of this stuff. Let's see. Hanra or Easy Rider. Oh, wait. Are you the... Let me see. Relationships. Oh, wow. Okay. Acquaintances. Dislikes good friends. Blah, 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 blah. Best friends. Good friends. Oh, wow. Can you see their family? Uh, best friend. Best friend. Can you see their family? Family. Easy Rider. Uh, easy Rider. Those must be family. But it doesn't say family. So that's what's kind of confusing. Let's check this girl out. Uh, unemployed, female adult, living with J Jimmy Arset, uh, just wandering. She's got a one. Uh, she's almost got a two of ten building skill. Okay. Now our stuff should be done. We have a 54 population. Our population has been on the rise. Give me these. Let's put 17 in this furnace. Um, let's put 16 in this one. There you go. Okay, so those are gonna smelt the day away. Now let's head over here and give, um, I can't even remember, Griffin, I think his last name was. Let's give him the rest of these supplies. And what time of the day is it, roughly? Okay, it's almost night. I don't know if we should head to the other city yet today. I think it's a little bit too risky. So let's place all this stuff in there. There we go. That was 124. Oh, he needs 147. So he needs more. But we got him a 9 brick. He should really be able to get this almost complete. Why are you hanging out with this guy here? What are you doing? Living with Ruby Kettle. He's a tenant. Um, he's unemployed. Okay, very good. Will we ever have enough buildings to employ all of our Sims? Probably not. Probably never. Let's see. The grocery store is looking really nice. I really like how Hercules did this. He did a really good job with everything. Okay, let's hatch that egg. No one, no chickens in there. We do. Okay, so we want the lumber mill, I think, right here. So let's go. They go from left to right. So let's build this right here and hire a builder. Let's get Hercules on this job here. Uh, we are going to choose a building. Industrial, I think it is. Uh, we want a lumber mill. There it is. 10 by 7 by 8. Um, we need glass and 308 planks. Okay, so 8 glass. That is not going to be a problem to get 8 glass. Uh, planks, it's going to be... It's not going to be a problem, but it's going to cost us quite a bit of our wood storage. So, uh, he's going to need way more than that. Um, let's actually chop down these. There we go. Give me all this. We're trying our hardest. We have a ton of saplings at home, so I'm not going to worry too much about trying to grab these saplings. Give me all that. Perfect. Okay, so this should be close to enough. I'm not quite sure. I didn't, I didn't count all the... I didn't do all the math. But this should be close to enough. And I, I think they changed the wood to the color they want it to be. So, I think using this birch will even work. Um, give me this. It looks like he was chopping down a tree. So let's t t convert that and perfect. Okay. So this is going to be one giant lumber mill. Um, and we can use that to basically harvest all these trees. And I put it on this back area because I want to make that whole area a forest. And that's where they're going to kind of go to, to start, uh, chopping down. Oh my God, it's getting dark. We better go. 
And uh, the rest of the cobblestone should be smelted for uh, this this uh, this butcher shop. So that that will be good. That will be really good. Uh, this this next day is going to be very productive, in my opinion. We are going to have a very productive day. So let's let's head inside the house. Go to sleep. Can't sleep yet. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we're going to sleep this off. Uh, bring the rest of the stone over to um, the little dude over there. Yeah, this is enough. Yep, this should be good. Okay, so this should be just enough stone for him to finish off the project. And we're going to head to the other city and start making up industrial areas. Um, like, like more farmland. I know we closed the farm, so let's see who we all have hired here. Show employees. A builder, a miner, a miner, a butcher. We're going to fire the butcher. Uh, we're going to... We're going to keep the cattle farmer going, obviously. We're going to open up all those farms. Uh, we don't need that butcher, though, because he's kind of useless, because we're going to have this great area over here with another good butcher. So we're not going to worry about them in that other city for now. Uh, so let's head over there, get all the farms up and running. We have a chicken farm. We have a sheep farm. We have all those. We have to get those up and running so we can actually start our com commerce over here and actually start making some money. So let's head over to the other city. We haven't been to this city in a, in a couple of episodes, I'm pretty sure. Maybe we swung by once, but it's been a while. We haven't built anything in this city in forever, so it's, it's been a long time. Let's go. Why do we only have one, one of these little things? Where are the rest? We're building the lumber mill. We're building the, the butcher. May, and Oh, wait, did I not take the one away from the grocery store? I'll have to check. Uh, but let's go here. Let's finish up these... Uh, these little farms, let's get everyone kind of working back. And when they were working, now they're, we're going to get them back to working. This lumber mill is going to stay closed, though. There's really no point. I kind of like how the city looks with the trees now. So we're going to let this city be. We're not going to harvest all of its wood anymore. We're going to we're gonna let it just kind of grow out to what it's supposed to be. Uh, but right here, here's a chicken farm that is currently has been running for a very long time. Uh, we are going to hire a chicken farmer. Annie Clinton can be our chicken farmer. Um, we got a whole bunch of feathers in there, all that good stuff. We'll let her chicken farm for us. Um, now what else is over here that we're not using? Um, I know we have the glass factory, but we're going to rebuild that, if anything, in our new city. Um, did I fire, I fired this wheat farmer down here, I'm pretty sure, too. Yeah, I did. Okay, so he needs to be hired again, because we, we need a lot of wheat. Uh, we're going to need the wheat for the grocery store. I'm pretty sure the wheat works for the grocery store. Uh, wheat farm, carrot farm. Oh, but he needs carrot seeds, and we don't have that. Um, sugar cane, cactus, potato farm, pumpkin farm, melon farm. Okay, we're gonna have to make it a wheat farm. Upgrade to level three. Upgrade to level three. Oh wait, let's hire a farmer. Okay, let's get uh, let's get the Amelia Underwood in here. Fully upgraded. Done. Okay. So she is gonna run this wheat farm like crazy. Uh, we need the. Oh, we didn't bring the sim markers. And we're gonna need seeds. So wheat is good and all, but we, I really, we like wheat isn't. I don't think we can run a grocery store with wheat, to be honest. Um, we need like melon seeds and stuff like that. I don't really know how we're gonna get melon seeds. So let's see. Um, the, she's only got one chest. I'm trying to think where I could find some quick melon seeds. I don't think we can buy melon seeds anywhere. I wish we could. It would be awesome. What about this witch's hut? Have we ever went in this witch's hut? I don't think we have. Maybe there's something in this hut that we can use. Let's see. Oh, there is a... There is a little... Give me that. Give me that wood. And where is it? There it is. I'll put that there, that there. Okay, up we go. Now what we're going to do is start building on this lily pad. We're going to try to get up there. Wait, can we not build on lily pads? Oh, darn it. Okay, so let's see. Um, eh, eh. What was I going to do? How can I do this? How can I do this in a way where it works? Okay, so there. Perfect. Okay, so let's go up here. Maybe there'll be some type of seed in here. Oh, there's a cauldron. And there's a crafting table. Okay, so pretty much nothing of, of great use in this little witch's hut. Crap. Okay, I really wanted there to be some type of seed in there. I'm trying to think where we can find melon seeds. I know we can just scour the land and hopefully find melon seeds, uh, but we haven't found any carrot seeds, any potatoes, nothing like that. That's going to all be hard stuff to find that we might have to actually find in like a, a chest somewhere. Oh, wait, I'm stupid. Here we go. A melon seed. We can break this down. There we go. Okay, so give me this. And perfect. So there, we have five melon seeds. So we can start a melon farm now. A uh, pumpkin farm. We don't need pumpkin. We can make pumpkin pie, technically. Uh, but we don't really need a pumpkin farm. 
Um, let's see. What what else? What what else do we need? Potatoes, potatoes, and potatoes and carrots. Let's take this pumpkin actually. Uh, let's put him in here. Give me some pumpkin seeds. Maybe we'll we will start a pumpkin farm. We can make pumpkin pie. Um, let's see. Do we have any wood? We don't have any wood left. Otherwise, I could fix this. I won't fix it now. Uh, let's head back because we are going to need the mine markers just to kind of build these little farms. Um, plus, I want to go find the rest of our semi craft uh, tables. So let's go do that. And we can uh, hopefully get these farms going. We'll have a melon farm. I don't know how many seeds we need to start it. I think we need enough to kind of fill the land. But what they'll do is they'll plant like the five seeds we have. And then they'll wait till there's more seeds. Then they'll plant those. And they'll keep planting and planting and planting. And eventually we'll have a full melon farm. And then we can collect those seeds to start another melon farm. It's just a slow process. So we'll do a melon and a pumpkin farm. And then hope that soon we can find carrots and potatoes. Because uh, I know you need that kind of stuff to open up a grocery store. And we're going to need that if we want to sustain life. Uh, so let's see. We need our little sim things. Uh, we need three of those. Um, I need more of our little simu crafters. So let's see. Uh, simu crafters. Where did we put the last couple? Um, I know we have them over here. Did he finish? Did he finish the butcher shop? He did. Okay, so the butcher shop is done. We can take this. Take that. Grab all these little loose signs. Uh, it looks really nice. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy for it. Why is that floating there? Oh, it went away. Okay. Uh, now where is the other? Oh, did he finish the lumber mill? Oh, he did. Awesome. Or did he? Yes, he did. Okay. So let's break this down. Take that. Awesome. Um, now I don't think there's any more over. Oh wait, there's one more right here. Give me that. And is there more here? Are they done? Did they finish these? They did. Okay. So we can take all of our sim crafters back. Okay, perfect. So now we have six and six. Holy crap. Okay, so let's put this up here. Grab the sim crafter. Grab the chest. So what we're going to do is we're going to start two farms on the other side. Is it almost night? No, it's not. Okay, it's still about midday. So we can still make it back there and we can start those little farms up. Um, we're going to need fence posts. We're probably going to need more than what I currently have. So we better go make some. I know that's what you need to make the farm. Dirt and fence posts. So we'll make sure we have enough of that stuff. Uh, let's grab this and that and let's make these into sticks uh, Split that up split that up. Okay, boom and Boom, and then we need these to turn into sticks Perfect give me those and now we need fence posts. So let's grab all of these We need a ton of fence posts. Oh god. I'm losing my voice a ton of fence posts put all that in there And there we go, and then we still have ten more Perfect. Okay. So it looks like we now have 104 fence posts. This should work out well. We should be able to do all of our farming stuff and then actually open up the grocery store and potentially the bakery. I don't know what you really need for the bakery. Uh, I would I would guess they're making cakes, so you probably need a chicken farm, which we have, for eggs. And then a cattle farm, which we have, for milk. We didn't open up our sheep farm. We have to remember to open that up. We need everything open so we can have a ton of imports. Even though it's going to cost us money every day, it's going to be worth it in the long run because we're making a ton of money anyways with our mines uh, and selling redstone to the bank at a premium. We're never going to hit zero dollars again. Knock on wood, tot tot, <laughs> just in case. <laughs> okay, so let's take that. Okay, perfect. So it looks like we have a few people here wanting to be lumberjacks. Um, let's see. What were we going to do? Let's build, the, let's build the farms all in the somewhat of the same area. Um, let's see. So we have that one right there. And if we had a grocer, they would come and pick up all this stuff. So we don't even need to. Let's put all this wheat back because then the grocer can come pick this stuff up. Um, okay, so let's start another farm. So what we're going to do is go uh, put this away, grab that. We are going to go with one. And then we are going to go with two. And then we are going to go with three. Okay, so this is how big this next farm is going to be. This is going to be a melon farm. And let's hire a builder. Or wait, no, cancel. Oh, wait, we need a farming box. Oh, I'm stupid. We need a farming box. Darn it. Okay, so we're going to have to go get a farmer's box. Oh, darn it, darn it, darn it. We need a hoe with wood and stone. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. We now have a level seven miner, though. I really want to get these farms going today. Uh, let's go check out the mines, I guess, before we head back to the house, since we're screwing up so much today. 
Uh, we're not actually going to take the railroad back. We're just going to walk it to the mines. So we only have two mines open. I'm hoping that there's some redstone. We only have 164 stack of redstone left, and I really want to start selling more redstone. So we're going to have to check in on that and make sure that uh, we have enough redstone reserves so we can sell some redstone. Oh, this is a giant uh, mine. Everyone be careful. <laughs> that ends in lava. Oh, my God. That would be horrible if I fell in there. Okay, so let's check this one out. It looks like they're getting pretty deep. See some iron and, and coal down there. So we got some iron, some flint, and some more coal. We don't even need coal anymore. That's almost one we can stop production on. But it is getting dark. It looks like it's about to turn night. Let's go check out this mine really quick before it does turn into darkness and before the monsters come out. Okay, so some more iron, coal, and flint. Nothing, nothing in the redstone area, which really sucks. So we really need redstone because we were making some really good money on redstone. I wish they would buy everything. I wish they would buy cobblestone. I don't even care if they buy cobblestone for a dollar a piece, you know. It's just like I wish they would buy everything so I'd have the option. I wish there was like a little shop I could put in here and kind of just sell everything. Um, but you guys, I think this is a really good place to end this episode. If you enjoyed the episode, remember to slap that like button, lemon heads. If you watch the whole thing, comment down below. Um, let's think. What were we all talking about this episode so I know you watched the whole thing? Uh, let's see. Okay, so comment down below. Uh bakery magic because we're about to be making some magical cakes magically delicious cakes in that uh that bakery so comment down below bakery magic i'll know you watch the whole episode and until next time you guys remember to take it easy live it squeezy